Hey everyone, welcome back to Zoll Hair Collection TV. My name is Nick, the owner of the Zoll Hair Collection. If you're tuning in with us for the first time, nice to meet you. Also too, something you should know is that we're always doing some giveaways on our videos, so make sure you hit the subscribe button below so you don't miss out on any opportunities. Now, let's get to it. Okay, so today what I wanted to show you all is how to wash your natural hair clip-in hair extensions. So natural hair, I mean like the kinkies, all the kinkies, the kinky straight, the kinky curly, the afro kinky. This one I'm wearing here is our Brazilian kinky curly clip-in hair. And also too, this is what I'm going to show you how to wash and condition your kinky curly clip-in. So I'm not gonna talk much. I'm just going to show you the footage and I'm gonna talk you through each step. Okay, so here are the hair extensions and also the products I'm going to be using for this video. Um, we always suggest using some kind of two-in-one or three-in-one conditioner, especially on natural hair textures. And then because I'm going to be doing a little bit deeper of a conditioner, I'm going to use the Wella or Weya. I'm not really sure how they say that, but um, I'm using that to finish up my conditioning process. I have a paddle brush and a plastic bucket. First thing I do is fill it up with some um, warm water and basically make a little bath for my hair extensions. You wanna put a lot of soap in there um, because with natural hair extensions, especially clip-ins because you have that metal clip on top, uh, you basically wanna do like a soaking method. You don't wanna rough up the hair too much um, while it's you know in a wet state just because it'll tangle and be a beast to detangle afterwards. Um, here you can see I rinsed my hair and this is what the kinky curly clip-ins look like after being washed. And now I'm taking my uh, way, Wella or Weya, I'm really not sure how you say that, but I just take a little dime-sized bit and I take my time and take conditioner all the way through from the root of the hair extension to the tip and then I take a paddle brush to detangle my um, kinky curly hair. And with uh, any type of deep conditioner, you know, we prescribe either um, L'Oreal's deep conditioner or uh, Weya, or Wella, however you wanna say it. Um, but it works super well with natural hair textures, especially um, the kinky curly and afro kinky. So after about, I don't know, 10, 15 minutes, I was finished detangling, and this is what the Brazilian Kinky Curly clip-ins look like after they've been washed and had some conditioner run through them. I've not put any Eco Styler or anything on it. This is just the natural, you know, texture there. So I'm all set. And look at this. Our little handy-dandy uh, travel bag has a hanger inside. This is a bag that we give to all of our customers when they purchase, but this hanger comes in handy to dry your extensions. Um, at this point, the extensions are still, you know, a little, little wet, so I just hang them on my doorknob. All right, was that helpful? I hope it was. Um, it's my simple technique to wash and condition my kinky textured hair extensions, and um, hopefully, like I said, it was helpful. All right, let's get to the free stuff, right? <laughs> okay, so today our giveaway is going to be one of our free travel bags. Now, this bag comes standard with all of our shipments, so if you order just a bundle or a closure or frontal or wig, it's gonna come in this bag. You're gonna unfold this baby and boom, your hair is gonna be inside. Um, so we are offering this lovely travel bag for free to the first three people to comment below on this video and also to subscribe. So the first three people to comment below and subscribe to our YouTube channel will be sent one of these bags. Now, I know you're asking, what is so good about this bag? So we offer this to our customers for free because we believe that our hair will last you years and years and years. And you spend good money for your hair. So why are you storing your precious hair in plastic bags or in a drawer somewhere. They should be hanging up on display. Well, kind of on display. <laughs> but this bag really does help with the life of your hair. This travel bag really is comes in handy. Like, 
Uh, first off, the material that it's made out of, it's very breath breathable. So I don't know if you've ever stored some of your hair extensions in a plastic bag or in a drawer. And even if they're clean, you open it up and it has like this musty smell. That is because just there's no air getting in there. This bag, the material in this bag allows for breathing to happen, for air to circulate through there. So you don't have that musty smell and have to rewash your hair again and again. Another great thing about this travel bag, it's super big. Like, I'm tall and it comes like past my, my boobie here. So it's super big so you can store a lot of hair extensions in there as well. And lastly, what is so great about this travel bag, because it's good for travel too, <laughs> It's this hanger that comes inside. I know a lot of our customers and people don't think much of this hanger, but this thing is... Uh, imagine this. Let's say you have your kinky curly clip-ins, your wavy clip-ins, your, your, your wig, whatever. You just clamp it in there and then snap it and then hang it on your shower curtain or whatever. And then you have your hands free to do twist outs or to straighten or even to color. So this thing comes in handy. That's it for today. We are gonna be doing videos every week. So again, another reason to subscribe because we are gonna be doing giveaways for every video. Um, and the giveaways will be different every time. All right. Thank you so much for tuning in to Zul Hair Collection TV. We look forward to seeing you next week for our new video. Audio Hub.